In this video, we will demonstrate the steps to disable delegated authentication for an Active Directory integration with Okta. When delegated authentication is enabled on a directory, Okta does not store passwords for users assigned to that directory. All password-based authentication attempts are delegated to a domain controller and passed back to Okta. If you disable delegated authentication, the assigned Okta users will not have a password unless the option to create Okta password is selected. If the user does not have a password, Okta will deactivate the Okta account. You can disable delegated authentication for Active Directory by going to Directory, Directory Integration, and selecting your AD domain on which you want to disable delegated authentication. Open Provisioning, then Integration, scroll to the header Delegated Authentication, uncheck the box, and click Save. When you disable delegated authentication, you are presented with two options. Create Okta Password or Don't Create Okta Password. Choosing the Create Okta Password option will send all users that previously used delegated authentication a password reset email, and users will need to go through the password reset flow so they will create an Okta password in order for them to be able to log into Okta. Alternatively, choosing the Don't Create Okta Password option will not send the password reset email to users, and users will not be able to log into Okta until an Okta password has been set. If this option is chosen, an Okta password can be created for users through an API call or when an admin sets a temporary password from the admin console directly. We have now covered the necessary steps to disable delegated authentication for your Active Directory integration with Okta. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to us on YouTube.